Interdimensional travel for the DL with Devin and Lisa provided by Limited Intel. Limited Intel, with their no anal fee, you can rest assured that your data is in incompetent hands. Tails, woo! Have you seen Battle Kitty? I love Battle Kitty. I love Battle Kitty. <laughs> um, uh... You want to rate Battle Kitty? Yeah, let's do that. I'll rate Battle Kitty right now. Okay, Battle Kitty. Let's do so. Battle Kitty plot. Oh, it might hurt on the plot. It has a good plot. Ah, uh, you know what? The overarching the overarching this, story is actually really oh, great. The thing that really hurts it is that it's a game, the mode or whatever. But I yeah. actually really like this plot. I would give the plot. A four. Three or four. I'm going to give it a four. Okay, what about the humor? Five. You're going five? Five. 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 I would watch it. I'd watch it by myself. Uh, and I think it's... Uh, I just want to say the only one we've ever given a five to before was Gravity Falls. You think it sticks up? It's it's on that level? Of a humor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would say so. Okay. I'm going five. Um, art style. That's where it's gonna suffer, dude. I don't really find the art style in it's any like way. Half and half. I'd give it like a. I want to give it. I want to give it more than. I'm be fair, gonna... cause it all overarches. Okay. Mm. Just be I'm gonna fair. It, I'm gonna give it a two. Okay, I'll stick with two. And that's because of the, the interactiveness of it and like the different. It's just it doesn't blend well, unfortunately. It really takes me out of the story and the plot. It detracts from the art style detracts from. I think so, too. Piece of work, I think. Kid friendliness. So remember, now this doesn't just mean like how much kids like it. It's like, what does it add to a child's brain? I'm going to say I inclusion, uh, self-empowerment. Self okay, what if we give it a three? Like, it's somewhere in the middle. It doesn't add a ton, but it is a good... Yeah. It's overall, you know what I mean? It's like a it's overall, It has a message overall, I think. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go, what, was, what, was the, what was the category again? Just no. kid. Oh, I'm going to go three. I gave it a three, too. Yeah. I would actually give it a two, but I'll round up for you since you love it so much. Adult adult enjoyment. I am an adult. I'm going to give it a four. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say five. I enjoy that shit. I think it deserves Eight. a four. I don't think it deserves a five. Even Gravity Falls didn't get a five in this one. For adultness? For adult entertainment. Yeah, you like how much it entertains the grown-up. It, it entertains me as, as a grown-up. I do. It, it like as it, it it makes me feel like childhood whimsy. You know what I mean? I know. Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna give it a four. four. We're gonna give it a four. If Gravity Falls is a four, it's got to be a four, dude. I'm sorry. Because I f I honestly feel that the majority of adults would probably enjoy Gravity Falls over. Exactly. Night. That's what I'm saying. Like a five out of five in this category would be you would literally put it on with no kids and around. Honestly, I think a lot of that is because of the interactiveness of it. I think that one that the art style just completely like I understand I guess what you're trying to go for, but it's just uh, didn't Yeah. Happen, you know what I mean? So it got a uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, an 18 out of 25, which is pretty good. We'll have to go back through the things and see what else got 18. Uh, well, Gravity Falls got a 23 out of 25. All right. And Puppy Dog Pals got a nine. That's way overrated. What was the one we just did? <laughs> Burger King? Burger King. What was it? BK. Yeah, you have it your way. What was the show we just did, dude? Darkwing Duck. Or that. Tailspin. No, before the one we rated. Oh, Battle Kitty. Battle Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> God, we're the worst. 
just stop. That's too much in the mirror. Okay. Plot. I mean, there are many plots. Is there an overarching plot? I mean, the plot was he was I making mean, jam. Yeah, she I mean, to the up, overall, to remade the show, it. Is there a plot to the overall show? Or it's just like, it's not serial. It's like just. Yeah, it's it's like individual episodes. Yeah. I mean, like he meets that girl bear a few times. They go on some dates and shit like that. But there's not. Yeah. Not I mean, I guess there's actually a plot because like her cousin comes and then there's a whole season where her cousin's there. But I'd still, I'd give it like a, a one or a two. I mean, the only reason I won't give it a one is because Morphle exists. So I would give it a two. <laughs> I'll give it a two. There's barely any plot. I'm not going to fucking sit here and try to defend its plot in any way. Um, the humor, I would also, I'm not trying to really defend the humor. <laughs> I'm not really trying to defend it. You know what? This is a terrible show. <laughs> Let me give it a three. Really? Like a neutral? Let me give it a neutral. It was cute. It's cute. I don't know about funny though. I'm like, oh, it's not like laugh out loud. It's not funny. It's not funny. I guess humor we could change to just enjoyability. Just I enjoy it. We could add enjoyability. Well, right now the cool thing about it, unless we're gonna oh, read we have the numbers. We have the twenty five. Yeah. We have the out of twenty. We can always do out of thirty. You know, I'm gonna add enjoyability at the top, and then we can. Um, decide whether it needs to be its own thing or if humor and enjoyability are basically similar. I don't know. Art I style. It, I like the art style. I'll give it a four on the art style. I find it soothing and uh I would give it a three. Yeah, I'm neutral. You're there. neutral on it. Yeah. I know a lot of people I think would give it negative. I find it you're right. I find it soothing and I don't find it particularly like anything that catches my eye, but it doesn't no. offend me. Doesn't like the just, badness of it, it is almost it can just be there you know what I mean yeah let's give it a three just I'll give it a three okay um how kid friendliness how much it adds to kids um, I don't know what, it's Dude. not had much mischief is what's that it's giving kids bad ideas one is it bad it's a one huh it's yeah, a one fun. And then adult enjoyability, it's a th- to me, I'd give it a three. I'd say it's a neutral. And it, for me, I know a lot of people hate it. Really? But I think the song is so cute that it. I'll give it a three. I'm neutral on it. I'm All right. Go out of my way to watch it, but at the same time, like, it, if it's on, it's on. Okay. It got a 12 out of 25. What did. Oh, yeah. One. Puts it right in the middle, which is, I think, exactly where it goes. Yeah. And Puppy Dog Pals got a nine. I so still it, feel like that's too high. We're gonna have to read <laughs> that. I feel like well, I did. for kid friendliness, we gave it a three. I think we should knock that down to a two. You're not learning anything from that. How to confuse people. Should we do it a Maybe. one? Should we give it a one? Yeah, I think we give it a one on that. No one's like, you're not getting anything out of that. Puppy Dog Pals is now a seven. <laughs> you're getting less out of that than a bad idea. The only thing we <laughs> gave it points for plot and points for art only a two so still negative okay. but for plot and art and i will say i think they do have actual plots as opposed okay. to like right don't they actually go save a town have adventures and stuff like that and, and the art i will give giving right. each puppy it's like it's breeds specialization to yeah. me that gives it one one little sniv in the art department from a one to a two because it is cute that like the Dalmatian is a fireman and the fucking German Shepherd's a cop. <laughs> That's kind of cute. I think a Paw Patrol. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> the entire night I've been thinking Paw Patrol. <laughs> the entire everything I have said about Puppy Dog Pals tonight has been about Paw Patrol. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs>